What's up? What's up, y'all? I know it's been a minute. I know it's been a minute. I know it's been a minute. But chill. But chill out, though, because I'm back. All right? I'm back. So be happy I'm back because I ain't had to come back. All right? But, yeah, I know it's been a minute. It's just, you know, like I just had to, you know, just, you know, take a step back. Just take a breather, you know, just. I, I needed that. I needed a minute, you know. You know, I just needed to uh just clear my mind, clear my spirit, you know, just just clear me out and stuff like that, you know, uh to just readjust and stuff like that, you know. I was uh like the Bible say, I was removing that dross, you know, the Bible say when you remove dross from silver it could be used. So, you know, I was just yeah, you know, just getting my spirit and everything else together, you know, so, but yeah, you know, I'm back, I know I was talking about, you know, uh, I know last time, that last video, and, uh, it's, it's just a choice, it's really just a choice or whatever, I know I was talking, you know, I know what I was saying, how I felt, and, and what I felt like doing and stuff like that, but you know, I, I didn't, I didn't, I ain't gonna do nothing crazy, I, I ain't gonna do nothing crazy, I know that's what y'all was thinking, huh? Oh yeah, you see, yeah, God, that's what she doing. She playing, she playing in the darkness. Yeah, she she went back to the darkness. She playing in the dark. That's what she doing, huh, God? Yeah, I knew, I knew it. Yeah, I know. I ain't gonna do nothing. I ain't gonna do nothing crazy. You see, that's what y'all get for thinking. Y'all should have been praying for me. Y'all wasn't praying for me. Nah, y'all wasn't praying for me. Y'all was, but y'all be talking shit though. That's what y'all be doing. Y'all be so worried, but was y'all praying for me? That's what y'all should have been doing. But anyways, I ain't go back to, I, I ain't go back, I ain't go do nothing God wouldn't want me to do, put it like that. Okay, so, um, yeah, you know, I was just clearing myself out and everything. I ain't gonna lie, act like I, you know, I wasn't, you know, I ain't about to act like I was by the line, I ain't cross it. You know, I was by the line, I just didn't cross it. You know, y'all should be proud of me. Y'all ain't proud of me? Oh, y'all not proud of me? That's all right. God proud of me. He been proud. What you mean? God been proud. He been told me that. Anyways. Anyways. But, uh, you know, he did have to come snatch me several times. You know, God had to come snatch me several times. Because God know, you know, when I be having my moments of, you know, weakness and, and not, you know, and, and just not feeling it and stuff like that. He know he got to come snatch me. He know. And he, and he had to come do it several times. Because God know. God know I don't be caring, y'all. Like, you know, I'm I'm godly, you know, and I care about my soul and I care and I try to stay on a narrow path. I'm not perfect, no, I'm not perfect. I'm not saying I'm perfect, you know, but I do be trying. But sometimes like I say, I just don't be I be God, it's a specific reason why I be saying I don't care. And God know, and it's not nothing to think to do with what y'all think. No, it's not nothing about this YouTube stuff or nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. It, it, it's like it's not. Just put it, put it like this. God know, God know a specific reason why I do not care, and He know. I be telling God, I be like, God, you know, I don't care. So God, if you care, come get me, come get me. You know, and that's the, you know, that's the most beautiful, precious thing about God is that he love you so much that even when you feel like giving up he ain't gonna let you give up he's not gonna let you you know even when you have them times even when you have the moments and stuff like that you know and i just love how even when i don't want to be kept he come get me you know even when i don't be caring he come care for me you know i love that about god you know even when i'm you know not worried he's still worried about me you know so you know he just would he just kept snatching me back you know i was you know the dreams and stuff and you know i was having spiritual encounters and all of that and you know it's just things he was telling me you know he was just he was really keeping it gangster with me i wish i could have tell y'all what he told me <laughs> i wish i could have told y'all what he told me but yeah you know that's what he was doing and i was just you know dealing with with myself dealing with things and stuff like that and just you know just like I say, I needed a, a little moment. I needed a breather and stuff like that, and that's what happened. So yeah, you know that's that's what was going on. Nothing, nothing else. But um, like I said, I'm back. You know, you know. So um, don't never think just because I'm gone. You know, I'ma just 
I don't, I don't want to return back or I'm not going to return back. I like being on YouTube. I like, you know, doing my thing and stuff like that, you know. But it's just sometimes, you know. But that's what I'm saying. When, when y'all see sis not here, y'all need to be praying for me. Don't be talking shit. Y'all need to be praying and stuff like that because y'all know what's going on. But anyways, so uh, I guess I'll just, you know, stop back with this dream. You know, this is a dream I had. This like, you know, just telling y'all how he was. You know, snatching me back because maybe somebody needs some snatching back too. Maybe y'all been, y'all feel like me. It's something like the the last video or whatever. Maybe y'all was feeling like me or y'all feeling like, you know, how I was feeling and stuff like that. So, tell you about this dream. Now, this dream I had, like, I think this dream I should have got on here and, and talked about it. But I didn't want to, you know, because I was ready to go backslide. Yes, I was ready. I was gone. Do the moonwalk. God, no. But anyways, he, uh, he, like I said, he was just snatching me back. Several, you know, he just kept snatching me, you know. So, yeah, I had this dream. Uh, like I said, I probably should have got on here and talk about it. Um, Like, right, like, after that video I did, you know, it's really just a choice and stuff. I had that dream, like, right, like, that same, that night or the next night one of them you know but i ain't i ain't wanna i ain't wanna get on here and talk about it because i know yeah but anyways i'm gonna just you know tell you about that dream and just things he was you know things that was you know so um in his dream let's see like i said he was snatching me back so this was one of the ways he was snatching me back so in his dream you know i was at this big old party y'all i was at this big old party and it was a whole lot of people, y'all. And I was just cutting up, acting up, doing what I want to do, acting crazy, just, just acting a fool, acting a fool, baby. I was the main ones cutting up at that party. It was a big old party, and I was just cutting up and everything. And um, and like you know, I uh left this party with a friend, and this was an old friend. And it was me and his old friend. And it was somebody else. I don't know who it was. But for some reason I felt like it was like some type of spirit or something. So I don't know. Maybe it just felt like it felt like kind of like it was a familiar spirit or something. Like it was me and his old friend. And like some type of figure. Somebody. Or like I said a familiar spirit. That's what I'm going to say. Because it just kind of felt like that. So anyways. We left the party. <laughs> We left the party and we went to this old, empty, dark building. Like I said, this was God snatching me back, okay? One of the ways he was snatching me back and stuff. So, like, yeah, me and this old friend and whoever else went to uh, this old building, this old, dark, empty building. And uh, we was looking outside the window. And they had, like, these two gargoyles. I'm not... I'm not sure that's how you pronounce it, so I'm going to say gargles. Okay, so they had these two gargles. Uh, I think it's gargoyles, but I'm going to just say gargles and stuff like that. So, uh, they had these two gargles that was on top of the roof, but like diagonal from the window we was looking at them through. Like on another side of the roof, but we could have seen them looking out the window and stuff like that. So they had these two gargoyles, and you see, they ain't nothing but demons. A, a, a gargoyle, a gargoyle, they ain't nothing but a, but demons and stuff like that. That's all they represent. All right. So I see these two gargoyles, and um, they were statues first. First, they were statues. They were statues. Then right after that, all of a sudden. They come running up the window trying to get me. And the people, like they wanted me, you know. And the people that, that was with me, they was like, look, look. But for some reason, I wasn't scared. So when they was trying to come get me, they was trying to come they was trying to come up the window and get me but when they was trying to get me, I was trying to get them when I realized they was trying to get me. So I was like, oh yeah, but come in. In. Come in. in. And I was trying to snatch them up. I was like, yeah, come on, I'm going to snatch y'all up. Come on, let's go. Okay, I wasn't scared. They was trying to get me. But for some reason, they couldn't. They, for some reason, they couldn't. It's like they was 
climbing up the window. They was climbing up the window, but it's like they they kept like I don't know. It was like going back and forth, back and forth. And like I said, I wasn't scared, so I was like ready to snatch them up, you know. So I'm trying to. They trying to come. They trying to get me, but can't. But then it's like I was trying to get them, but I couldn't get them. That's crazy, right? They was trying to get me, but they couldn't get me. But then I was trying to get them, but I couldn't get them. And I was ready to get them. Like, I was ready to get them. I wasn't running on nothing. I was ready to get them. So, uh, for some reason, like I said, for some reason, I couldn't. So, in a dream, what I did was repent for the way I was living. And I start, I said, I repent for the way I'm living or something like that. I said, I repent something. But it was like for the way I was living. That's why I couldn't get them like that. And I, and I was, uh, I repented for the way I was living or whatever I said. And then I started pleading the blood of Jesus Christ against them demons. And all of a sudden, they just start disappearing. They just start like melting away. They just start like dissolving. And then I told the people I was with, whoever I was with, I was like, y'all see how I repented and I, for the way I was living. And I plead the blood of Jesus Christ. I said, oh. So let me point out the, 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 uh, how I couldn't get them. Okay, you see, I couldn't, they couldn't get me right. And I couldn't get them. And why is that? That's because they couldn't get me because really I know who I am in Christ. And I stand in that. They really couldn't get me. But they had some kind of, they had, I was giving them some kind of, you know, way. Uh, uh, what you call it? I was giving them some kind of opening, some kind of way to come get me right. That's why they 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 could they was coming after me because I gave them some access. Yeah, I gave them some access, but they really couldn't get me because my faith and and who I am in Christ and I really do stand in Christ. But I couldn't get them because I wasn't standing in Christ like I should have been. You know, like. They couldn't get me cause cause my faith in how, who I know who I know I am in Christ and I couldn't get in them because I really wasn't all the way in Christ like I should have been. You know, so like I said, that was God snatching me back. You know. And then another and then it was another part of this dream where like I was someplace, like another part of something that was a whole lot of people. And I seen demons. They had some demons, y'all, come after me, y'all. They had some demons come after me. And they formed, like, it was some demons come after me, but they formed, like, this whole blob. They formed this whole blob, and, and um, they was trying to come get me. So it was, like, demons that can't, that uh, formed into this whole blob trying to come after me. But they didn't get me. And they had, like, this woman, I don't know, she was trying to tell people, I don't know what she was doing. I think she was trying to, like, get people together and stuff like that. But I don't know. But, you know, it's just, you see, that's what, that's, that's what God was showing me. Like, you know, like I say, them demons, they had formed into this whole blob. And that reminded me of the, um, the Bible scripture where it say, you know, when a demon leave, when a demon leave, it, um, it, it go and then it come back with seven more spirits, you know. And then a, the state of that man is worse off than a, than a, the the state of that man is worse than he first was or whatever. Y'all know what I'm saying? And that to me right there, that's what it was looking like. Like God was saying, yeah, you know, you go back. All these demons going to come for you and you're going to be worse off than you like ever was or whatever, you know, and stuff like that. You know, so I was like, okay, God, I'm a chill. All right, I'm a chill. God, I get you. I get you. Okay, okay, I'm a chill. But that don't mean I was, you know, I was saying I was going to chill, but that don't mean I still wanted to. So that's why he has to keep snatching me back several times. Okay, so, um, uh, so, um, uh, yeah, that was one way. And then another, another way, y'all, uh, I had this spiritual encounter. And y'all, it's like, like I said, you know, I was, you know, so they had these, I had this uh, spiritual encounter where they had these demons pulling me out of the bed, y'all. Like they were saying, come on, come back. And I was like, I want to come back. Like Chucky was saying, you want to play? I was like, yeah, Chuck, I do. But I can't. You know, it, it, these demons, they was like trying to 
it was like in real life, you know, them spiritual encounters when you're sleeping. It's not supposed to be perilous. It's this what's going on spiritually, stuff going on spiritually. So these demons was trying to pull me out of the bed, y'all. These demons was trying to pull me out of the bed, trying to get me to go back. They was waiting. You see, Satan, he be waiting for us to go back. He waiting. He waiting. He waiting to give us, to give him that opportunity. Oh, yeah, them demons in his, you know, they waiting. They waiting for you to go back and stuff like that. And you see, I also wanted to say, uh, about the, you know, that, that first part of the dream where I couldn't really defeat the demons because I was basically on the side of the enemy. You see, when you, when you, when you teaming up with Satan, you can't go against Satan. You can't. You know, when you teaming up with him and then you on his side, you can't fight against him, you know, because like, like the Bible say, how you, uh, well, I'm not going to, yeah, I guess I could say that, you know, a, a house divided cannot stand or whatever. So if you standing with Satan, you can't, it's like you, you can't go against him. You might as well, you know, not even be, you know, trying to fight against the enemy because it's a, it's a losing battle if you're teaming up with them. That's why I couldn't, you know, defeat them demons until I repented. Until I repented for the way I was living in a dream. You know, that wasn't going on in real life. That was just God snatching me back. You know, so, um, yeah, like I said, you know, it was that. And he just was, just things he was telling me, you know. And, um, like I said, I ain't, I ain't go back. I ain't go play in the darkness. So, so. So I just want to, you know, encourage anybody. Like I said, it's it's like the last video or whatever. If you if you live in that life, you know, for the world, for the enemy, it's just it ain't worth it, you know. And you can have a good time on life. You can have a good time in your life and stuff like that. And right now, but you know, when that day come, like I said, when that day come, you you know. If you ain't right with Christ or if you ain't trying to make the attempt to get it right with Christ, you know, you're going you're gonna to be sorry, you know. You're going to regret it. Don't feel like it not, you know. And like I said, I understand. I just not know, you know, I'm not judging nobody because I know, you know, like I said, I'll be tempted to do stuff and, you know, I'll be tempted and stuff like that. And, you know, sometimes I might, I might fall down, you know. And But you see, the thing about me is... Uh, <laughs> You see, I'd rather fall in a, a little small hole and get right back up than fall into a big, deeper hole and, and, and have a hard time getting up out that hole, you know? So, uh, yeah, um, but 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 all glory to the Father for coming and snatch me, you know, before I, before I get like that. And um, so, like, you know, I just want to encourage people, y'all, like, just is, I understand, but it's like I said before, you just got to make a choice and stuff like that, you know? That's all I got to see, you know. Uh, but, yeah, I'm going to get back to this thing here. So, um, I was just sharing my dream and stuff like that. And, you know, my just encounters, my encounter and everything. And, you know, it's just all kind of stuff. All kind of ways he was snatching me back. But, yeah, y'all just, you know, like I said, it's a choice. You know, um, I'm with y'all. I feel for the ones who, who in the world and, and are you know, uh, just living the way they want to live and stuff like that. I understand, but it, like I said, you know, it's just, it's really just up to you. It's up to me and stuff like that. You know, we in this together. You know, it's all, it seem all, it seem fun now. It seem cool now. It seem, it seem, you know, it's all smiles and, and joy now, but when that day come, you know, we gonna feel it if we ain't ready, so... Yeah, y'all, that's that dream, you know. I probably should have been put out there and stuff like that. But, you know, I was, you know. But, uh, like I said, I'm going to be back, you know. So, all right. Uh, um, y'all going to see me. All right.